Hi my loves, thanks for returning. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be a lipstick and a lip product declutter. I really don't know the proper etiquette on these, so I'm just gonna do the best that I can. I will have a declutter bin, uh, AKA trash. I will have a bin that is for lipsticks that I'm gonna give away to a family member or friend. I will try to swatch a few here and there. So with that being said, Let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so here I have some LA Girl, what are these, flat finish pigment glosses. And I really did like these when I bought them initially. I haven't reached for them in ooh, over six months. So I'm going to put these in the bin to give away to a family member or friend, so. Next, I have these. Uh, these are Makeup Revolution Salvation Velvet Lacquers. And uh, I really wasn't too wowed by this formula when I first got these. The colors are, this color is pretty unique to anything in my collection. So I think I will keep this one, but these three I will be decluttering. I'm going to put this in the bin to give away to a family member or friend. So next I have my Profusion Feline Lip Lusters and the part, the, the, it says lip luster, but that has always confused me. And I haven't reached for these shades in over six months, probably even longer. I really do like this formula. I like, um, I like the brand Profusion. Since I haven't reached for it in such a while, I will be decluttering these. And I'm gonna give those to a family member or a friend. Okay, so these are some NYX glosses. And these are some really pretty colors. I actually like all of these colors, so I will be keeping all of these. I only have one of these and I wish I had all of the colors. This is the Tarte Lip Sculptor and you get a lipstick on one end. This color is so pretty right there and you get a lip gloss on the other end which is the same color as the lipstick very pretty i will be keeping that next i have these two jouet what are these cream okay let's see these are the lip toppers and this is in i skinny dip this is in skinny dip and this is in tan line first of all these smell so good Second of all, they are so pretty. Third of all, I will be keeping both of these. If you all have not tried this brand, you have totally been missing out on a treat and you really need to. These colors go, like it said, it's a lip topper. So it goes really well when you mix it with another lipstick. So I most definitely will be keeping these. Next I have three Buxom products and I think that these are hands down the coolest packaging in my collection. They're all magnetized and as you can see that it has the word Buxom on front and if you try to close it the wrong way the magnet will automatically take it to where it's supposed to be and I know you're like Bridget this isn't about the packaging it's about the lipstick but since I am a packaging fiend, I just had to show you that. I love all of these colors, love the formula. I have been using these and yes, I will be keeping these. Okay, so here I have some Nika K matte lipsticks and originally when I bought this, these uh, lipsticks, I thought that they were the bomb. They have since dried out, plus the packaging looks gross. It looks like that I probably have had these forever, but honestly, probably maybe had them a little over 12 months, but all of these are going to be decluttered and in the trash bin. Okay, so here I have some Nika K products. I have a Nika K matte lipsticks, and I have, let's see, four of those and I have two of their lip shines which are right here and I have two of their aqua lips and one of their lip glosses and I really love these this formula I like all of these colors these are some of my favorite colors especially this kind of shade I like the weird darky type of shades 
I like that shade, this vampy color right here. And this formula, the lip gloss, for these to be just a dollar, the pigmentation is, to me, it's really good. So with that being said, I will not be decluttering any of these. These are like super affordable. Let me go ahead and swatch the aqua formula for you. So it's just a little bit more hydrating than the matte, but all of these I will be keeping. So here is kind of like a hodgepodge of some liquid lipsticks. These are, which I'm sure all of you all are familiar with, the NYX Liquid Suede. I will be decluttering these, haven't reached for these in a while. These Malibu Glitz, I will be decluttering those. This liquid lips, this liquid suede lipstick, I will keep this one. I love the color. Okay, and same with the lingerie. I love the formula and I like the color. So I'm going to be actually, I'm not gonna give these away. Uh, they're, they've gotten kind of old. I'm gonna go ahead and throw these away, but these two I will be keeping. Okay, so here I have some Milani products. I have a Milani lip gloss. I have two metallics and these are matte. I do not like this formula and I will be putting this in the bin to give away. I will be keeping these because I like these. So I have two ColourPop liquid lipsticks. I really like these colors, although I have not reached for these two products. So I am going to keep these. Just let me show you really fast the color. So this color is Fragile Things Prim, I think. So really pretty. I'm gonna keep those. Here I have some LA Girl Lip Paint Glaze. I haven't reached for these in forever. They're really sticky and really messy in my opinion. So I think I'm just gonna toss those out. Okay, so here I have some NYX products. I have the NYX High Voltage Lipstick. I have the Butter Gloss and I have the Cream Matte and the Glam Lip Gloss. So I really do like these and I especially like this color right here, but because it looks so dingy and gross to me, I think I'm gonna toss this out and just repurchase this color. I do like the Butter Glosses, so I will keep this shade. I especially like this color. This is in praline and this just looks awesome I think as a nude color on brown skin. So these two I will be keeping and these I will be throwing away only because I don't want to give this to someone because that looks gross and I don't even think that anyone else would be happy with that formula. It's just I, I don't like it. So here I have my MAC Snowball Lipstick Collection and I just recently got this this past December. I'm going to be keeping these. However, I haven't reached for these in probably since I bought them. Well, no, I take that back. Probably within the past three months. If I don't reach for them within the past three months, I will be giving this set away to a family member or a friend. Here I have my Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick palette. For those of you who watch me and you're familiar with my channel, you know I love lipstick palettes, so I will be holding on to this. I have my Urban Decay Vice lipstick palette. I enjoy this palette and I will be holding on to this. Here are my Kat Von D lip liners. I love the formula of these and I will be holding on to these. Here is my Smashbox lipstick palette. These are the Be Legendary formulas. I will be holding on to these. I love this formula and I love this palette. Here is the BH Cosmetics Ultimate 28 color lipstick palette. These are some really nice lipsticks. However, I haven't reached for these in over seven months, I know. So I'm going to pass this along to a family member or a friend. Here are some lipsticks. Uh, this is Fresh Frost in MAC. That is gross. That is going in the trash. This is a Revlon lipstick color in Jubilee, I think. That is gross. It's going in the trash. Although the color is this 
just has always been my favorite go-to color and that's why I have used it down to the nub. Here is a Buxom Whipped Liquid Lipstick. I hate the formula of this little guy. Of this little guy, so I will be throwing, well, I'm not gonna throw it out. I'm going to put this one in the giveaway bin. Okay, so here are the classic Revlon Bullet Lipsticks, and these are the Revlon Super Lustrous Lipsticks. So let's just go through these really fast. This one right here, I still got quite a bit to use up, so I'm gonna hold on to that. This one is in Demure, and it's a pretty color. I haven't used a lot of it, but I do like to have something to just grab that's not too complicated, and that's just going to give a light wash of color, so I'm gonna be holding on to that one. This shade, which is Peak, pink cognito same thing just a real light wash of a pink color i'm gonna hold on to that this one is a really baby doll type of pink on me and that color is prime rose i'm gonna hold on to that color this one i'm going to declutter I'm gonna toss that out in the trash because that is old carnival spirit not sure why that's looking all beat up, but I don't want to give that away to anyone. So that's going in the trash. This one is Wild Orchid. This one is gorgeous, but it looks gross as you can see. Look at the color. This color is so pretty. I need to buy another shade. <laughs> well, you know what? I'm just going to keep this one. I'm gonna keep this one because I love this shade so much, <laughs> but I need to use it up. So I'm gonna keep that one. This one is Terra Copper. And this is another shade to where I can just get a light wash of color. So I'm gonna hold on to that one. This one is Nude Attitude. And I really like this because it is what it says. It's nude and it looks really good with a brown lip liner. So I'm gonna hold on to that one. This one is Love That Red. Oh my goodness, isn't that so pretty? That is so gorgeous. I don't reach for it even though it is beautiful. I'm gonna pass it along to a family member or friend uh, just so it won't go to waste. Next, I have the Lancome Le Boost Rouge lipsticks. These are really pretty. I love these shades and I love the formula. I will be holding on to these. Very, very pretty. If you haven't tried their formula, the matte form, these are matte and they are very, very comfortable. Those are the two shades. Okay, here I have some Wet n Wild like Chubby Stick lip color, moisturizing lip colors. Um, I think I got these in like a gift set or something like that. I haven't used these, so I will be throwing these away. I don't like the formula and I don't think anybody um, would like that formula. So I'm gonna toss those, plus they're old. These are the Ruby Kisses Maracuja Kid Sticks and I don't like these only because they have like a menthol type of taste or sm taste and smell but, but these little guys are super pigmented. You can get these out of the beauty supply store and they're really inexpensive. If you have if you've seen them before and just been wondering about them, I would say check them out. These are super old and I will be throwing these away. These little guys are pigmented. I don't even know if they sell these things anymore. I can't even get that top off. Let's try this one. So yeah, I'm going to, there's that pink color right there. Now that I've made a mess, they're just messy. I'm going to be tossing these. So these are some lip glosses, a lot of them, this one has been used a lot, so I'm just going to toss that one out because it's almost gone. Same with this one. This is a, this is Black Radiance. This is a Revlon uh, gloss, and this one is a Revlon. This is Maybelline. This is Revlon, and this one is Black Radiance. 
I'm going to be tossing, uh, decluttering all four of these simply because they're old. So these four will be going in the trash. Okay, so here I have four of Lime Crimes uh, Praley lipsticks. All of these, in my opinion, are really cute. I think that they look pretty cute on my skin tone. So I will be holding on to all of these. Here is one of the colors and this is in Gemma. And there it is there. This is Beetle. It's a really pretty color. And all of these, not sure if you can tell, have a metallic -y type of finish, which I personally really like. This is in Asphalt. And this is kind of like a, a gunmetal type of color. And this one is in Mirage, I think. Just really pretty. I like all of these shades and I will be holding on to all of these. Here I have three lipsticks from Urban Decay. This is from the Jean, Jean Basquiat collection and all of these colors I really really like and I'm gonna hold on to these that's a really pretty color this is in exhibition and this is their comfort matte this one is in abstract I really like this nude color I think that it looks excellent on my skin tone it's so much of a nude I don't even think that you can see it on my skin tone and this one is in epigram and it's another really really pretty color okay so I'm gonna be holding on to those and here are my lip stories from Sephora I recently purchased these I'll leave a card up above if you are interested in seeing swatches to those but I am going to be keeping those and here are a few of my uh, pop, pop art lipsticks from BH Cosmetics and I got these on sale for two dollars which I think that that's a fair price for it for these products and what I personally like about these lipsticks is the formula I think that they are really creamy and I mainly use these to do ombre looks because the formula is so creamy but there is like one of the shades they're so creamy and they're super pigmented as you can see i think that these are just some really nice lipsticks especially for the price now I think they're normally on sale for $10. I don't know if I would pay $10 for those, but I paid $2 for them and I thought that was a steal. Okay, so here I have, let's see, four of my Smashbox Be Legendary lipsticks. You know, all of these shades are really pretty and I'm gonna hold on to these even though I do have the palette. I don't have any of these colors in my palette, especially this chocolate shade, which I think is so pretty. Awesome. That looks so gorgeous. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be keeping all of these shades. Plus a lot of them are nudes and nudes are a real easy go-to color for me. That isn't a nude, but it's still a pretty color. I, too. I have these little mini liquid what are these the suede lipsticks and you know how you can buy them in a kit and that's what I did and that's what those are right there so I'm gonna hold on to all of those because I do use those frequently as well as this MAC lipstick in candy yum yum so I'm going to review this drawer this is my Too Faced lip injection what does it say extreme instant and long-term limp plumper I don't like this thing. I'm not going to throw it away only because I paid $28 for it and I don't want to waste my money. So I'm going to use this one up. And the reason that I don't like it is that it burns my lips too much. And I never knew how much I hated these things until I bought this. So we'll be holding on to this. The next one is my Bite Beauty in Gaza Paco. Paco, I was recently gifted this and by no means am I decluttering this little baby. 
um, because I just got it and I also got the lip liner to go with it which is awesome so that is super pretty another product that was gifted to me recently which I'm not going to be decluttering anytime soon is the rock with you NYX power mat and these this girl is the business <laughs> I wish I had every shade so I will be holding on to her this uh, Tarte lip paint is one of my all-time favorites I'm not sure if you've tried any of Tarte's liquid uh, their lip paints but they are so thick and unbelievably glossy beautiful we'll be holding on to that as well this one right here is a lip topper by urban decay and this is in litter looks like i'm going to be giving this one or decluttering this one because i don't reach for it um wow now that i look at it i see why i bought it it is pretty hmm anyway gotta think about that one all right, and these are my Kat Von D liquid lipsticks. I will not be declaring any of those. And these, I like all of these like the lava lip paints. So I am going to declutter the older lip lavas, which would be these two right here. The other three I will be keeping. Okay, so here I have all of my Too Faced matte liquid lipsticks right here. I'm going to be keeping all of these. I have a Urban Decay lip gloss in Brick House. This color is really pretty and I'm going to be keeping this color. This is a Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lip gloss in sepia. It's a really, really pretty color on my skin tone and I'm going to be keeping that one. This is a liquid lipstick in Prescotti and this color is super pretty on my skin tone and I'm going to keep that one. And this one is a lip gloss, a Bare Minerals lip gloss in Minx. And I'm going to keep that one. This one I'm almost finished with. So I think by the end of this year, I think I will be finished with this one. So that concludes that little drawer. And then my last drawer has all of my Lime Crime Diamond Crushers um, and some liquid lipsticks. And I'm gonna be keeping all of the diamond crushers and that's because I like using them on top of liquid lipsticks and lip lipsticks and it just you can just really take it to a, another level with the, with these little guys and this is black unicorn plus these smell so good this one is in strip and that is it right there they look so pretty when you add them on top of another color. And I've also seen people use this, these on their eyes. Um, this one right here is a Stila Glitterati. This is a lip topper. This is so pretty. I'm not giving this away. This one has, a, and I don't even know if you can see it. So, but it has little fine, pieces of glitter in it and you can either wear it solo or you can wear it on top of a lipstick not even sure if you can see that but that is so pretty and it when it settles it looks like water but you have to kind of you have to shake it up to activate it okay so my next one i'm keeping this one my husband gave me this one plus every time i wear it i get so many compliments uh that is the lip gloss side, okay? And here is the lipstick side. So just two really, really pretty colors. Um, and here I have some Anastasia Beverly Hills lip, liquid lipsticks right here. Um, will not be, I just bought this one. These two are relatively older, but I still wear them and I won't be de decluttering them. And then the last item is a BH Cosmetics. This is a metallic liquid lipstick and this one's pretty. 
Um, I need to wear it a little more. It is relatively new to my collection, so I need to see how I like it. Okay, and actually I see another product that I didn't talk about. This is the Queen. This is a Queen liquid lipstick. And this is another one of those gray type of lip colors, undertone gray mauve type of colors that I like. I will be keeping that one. Um, also, have you all seen any of these expert last lip lacquers? by NYX let me show you how pigmented those are can you see that I don't even know if you can tell maybe it's just the color this one's old so I'm going to be throwing it out um, but I do plan on replacing it those are the business if you see that brand you really ought to check it out okay I think I pretty much got everything so that pretty much concludes all of my declutter. All Everything that I decluttered or will either be going in the trash or to my mother, sisters, or a cousin. Also, the only lip liners that I showed you all or decluttered or were a part of this declutter were my Kat Von D lip liners. I really had too many of the just drugstore lip liners and I didn't want to kind of bore you all and go through that. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching and tuning in and until my next video, smooches.